Hazy, I think you also have problem with creating levels, so I'll show you how to create after tile sets for driving levels in 2D Unity. First you need to get a necessary package to work with tiles. Open Windows, Packet Manager and type tile into the search. These two packages should be available and installed at your place. And yes, if you have something else, check if the guide is outdated, because update are always a delicate matter. And now you need create or download a tile map with a texture with all the tiles and view placement variations. But default Unity will preserve it as a single sprite and add a small blur, which may be critical if you have a pixel time map like me. To solve this problem, do the following. Sprite mode set to multiply. This will allow to the sprite in the tile map in the separate sprite. In case of pixel, specifically with size in pixel per unit and remove the blue by setting into filter mode point, saving the changes. Now it's time to split the sprite in the sprite editor. Here you can select sprite both manually and automatically. Usually tiles having the same dimensions, so it's easy to divide them by grid by specifically its dimensions. Anti tiles will not be involved and we exit after saving the changes. If you did everything right, then you can open all the tiles by clicking on the play icon and the sprite. Next, create a grid. Right click, 2D object, tile map, rectangular. As a result, you have shown having such a grid. Now you need to create a rule tile. Right click on the empty space in the folder, create 2D tiles rule tile. This tool will allow you to draft tiles with automatically choice when on texture based on position and can even be randomized and animated. Open your tile map and drag and drop the tiles. The top one will be the default tile. For connection rule, you need to specifically the presence of adjacent tiles. Arrow, half tile, cross, no. Where is the pressing and the bottom? But it often looks strange. It's so better to check the tiles in the practical, since they can always be read on. To the output, select the sub item in the new fields and tile variations. For open the tile palette, click on the tile map and on the icon in the current in the screen. Drag your rule tile to the palette. Use the pipette to select a tile and drop your level on the grid. To give your tile set properties, just add the appropriate component to it. I also want to mention that tiles can be added not only from one tile map, but in general all the textures and you can replace existing ones by simply drag them to the place on the previous ones. So, don't worry when you wanted to update your textures, it's quick and easy. But so, uh, but no, but no, no. Uh, I am like, <laughs> I have a strong interesting thing and we link in the description, comment, <laughs> and 
Thank you. Sixth. That is still subscribed to my wish. Bye bye. See you soon.